Okay, it beats on his mad because he admits he beats on his girlfriend over not knowing how to make coffee. Well, then, let's see. If you're really serious about being in the Navy, you don't even know enough respect to be in the Navy. Because you would get mad if... if what do you mean, sergeant, respect? Because if you would get mad if a drill sergeant yelled in your face, you would probably get mad and sit over at a tree and cry like you did when you're Okay, dead. yeah. And, oh yeah, and and, and and you and you flip and you got all depressed because Caitlin stopped talking to you. You got all depressed because be, you got no no you got all pissed off because my dad yelled at you over being out at night. You like punched the dresser over my dad yelling at you. Yeah. That's like that's one for, that's one from me, but then there's three from you. Oh, dude, I remember the time you like intensely raged at your dad. Yeah, no, 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 you also intensely raged that you punched the dresser hella hard and nearly hurt yourself. But anyway, why are we talking about this? This is irrelevant of what we were actually talking about. Again, you get off topic like always, you dumb, angry emo kid. You get off topic, and then, and then, like, and then, like, when you try to be funny, you always talk about anal. Yeah, you and your little butt buddy Antonio need to like really stop talking about it. It really, it's I'm not gonna, fine. it's really not gonna reflect good on you too. Okay, uh -huh. CJ. Yeah, whatever. Cause you're so boss. Can't even no, fight, dude. Yeah. You can't even fight. You you haven't even been into a fight, I bet. Well, I, ha I bet you have, but you always get whooped by goth kids. Actually, no, no, no. You get whooped by vamp kids. I didn't say I could fight. Dude, you got whooped by two vamp p punks. I didn't say I could fight, though. That's the funny thing. I never said I was the best fighter where I could fight. It's, that's you jumping to conclusions. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I'm a compulsive liar, and you're a douchebag. And there's your famous saying, your little... That, the douchebag is like your exact calling card. Because you get, because you get mad at your girlfriend over not knowing how to make coffee. Because it's a simple task. You know what she was doing? She's trying to fit that dress that was in the coffee grounds in the coffee pot. So I lost my temper. Because you don't pull, just guess who has to clean it out all the fucking time? Me. Every time she puts something up, I always had to handle it. So you admit that you yelled at her over that? Well, uh, you were on the phone. So you would know, so I have to admit to nothing if you already know about it. You know, this is the thing with you, dude. You just, I don't, I, I you, you, you scare me, dude. Sometimes you're, you're, are you knowledgeable? Am I what? Acknowledgeable. No, okay. What does that have to do with anything we were talking about? What kinds? Well, let's see. Your girlfriend's crazy. No, she's not. Nope. Yeah, because my dad doesn't talk to anyone. He just gives them a blank stare. The only time when he ever talks to someone is when he's not hanging around Nikki. Well, okay, well, maybe because he doesn't want to hear how... Oh, I got jumped in Mesa. It's just nobody likes me. Oh, and then I hate my life, and my that's, Okay, yeah, yeah, that's totally what she talks about. You're so right, CJ. Again... 100% douchebag. You know what? I should just call you the angry douchebag kid. Dude, she seeks attention from everybody. No, that... Actually, okay, what about you, mister? I feel like dying. I'm so depressed. I never said any of that. Yeah, you did. Over text messages, you were saying, I feel like dying. I'm like, dude, calm the hell down. Again, because, be, be, because you're getting all, like, pissed off about... Okay, you know what? 
Apparently, 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 you have like mental law, mentally like no, you have like what is it? Short term, me no, yeah, short term memory loss where you'll forget shit easily. Short term memory loss. Yeah, short term memory loss, which is definitely what you have. You can't remember those times. China. Okay, that, okay, yeah, because you're CM Punk, all right. Yeah, dude, yeah, big bag. Yeah, yeah, come up with your, come up with the, come up with your own materials. New con, new concepts for you, huh? Hey, we're going to Sally, we're going to Sally with the Crocodile Dundee. Really? You're the Miz now? Really? Yeah, really. Really? 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 No, I said you're the Miz now. Yes, 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 yes. You're not Daniel Bryan. Think a little more of your brain and not so much your ass, CJ. Yeah, you guys have some and don't even know what it means. Yeah, it's still funny. It means that you. It means that okay. Where does shit come from? Your ass, and you. Th technically. Technically, get the shit out of your head and think a little more yeah. with your brain. You, you don't say it right. What are you, some BMX wannabe? Go jack off to some to some Ryan Sheckler videos or some shit. Why don't you go complain to somebody about how those why, why, why don't you go jack off to some Justin Bieber photos? Those BMX kids can always kick your ass. The ones who say bully you or pick on you or whatever. Yeah, okay, because the BMXers actually know how to fight. That's why they always get put, they, they always push you out of a fight when someone wants to fight them and they're not in groups. That's the only time they'll act tough is when they're in groups because they need their little boyfriends to fight for them. Unlike you, okay, you get your ass kicked by two fucking vamp kids. That's sad. By two what? By two fucking vamp kids. You know what vamp kids are? Basically, they they dress like they dress like punk, like gothic punk rockers. They dress in like they dress in like clothes, wear how like gothic wear, long hair, and wear like boots. Those are vamp kids. That's it. I'm just gonna admit it. I'm just gonna admit it right now. I'm a pacifist. You're a. That's why people beat me up. You're a pacifist. Yeah, bullshit, CJ. You're not yeah, Catholic. It's not about religion. I just feel that I don't need to fight because violence. Okay, yeah, because the fending for fending for yourself is so is like against your morals, I guess. Okay, okay. What about that this one gothic kid that called you a beaver fag and punched you in the face? Yeah, compulsive liar. Yeah, no, no, you lie a lot of shit, dude. You, 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 you lied about the Carson fight. You're all telling me my, oh, my shoes are red because I look hella different because I was, because I was on the ground with this kid. No, you showed me a fucking video of two black dudes fighting in a fucking parking lot. Yeah. And yet, 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 you call me the compulsive liar. Think a little more with your brain and not so much your ass, CJ. New, there's that's a new concept for you. I'm offended that you made fun of BMXers because I am a BMXer. Oh yeah, right. Yeah, at my dad's house. I have a bike. Okay, okay, okay. What kind is it? A fucking BMX bike. What brand? Fox. It's like Chance has it's black. Fox. What? A Fox bike. Okay. Yeah, and I've actually been learning hell of shit because I hang out with BMXers now. Dude, you're you're a wannabe. You're a wannabe. You don't know how to do nothing. You're you're like the like trend kind of person. Like like I like, like, for, first off, it was all about emo. Now then you wanted to be emo. You try to look emo. You listen to you only listen to Ask Alexandria because they're emo. I actually like their music. Oh, okay, 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 let's see now. 
there was the dubstep trends where you like dubstep and then and then you're trying to get rid of all your metal C so you gave me motionless and white and then like now oh I decided I like metal and then now I decided I like dubstep and metal and now you're trying to be swag and now you're trying to be a BMX wannabe Next next thing you next thing I'll know you'll try, probably try to be Mormon Well, I don't know that. Why not? So why don't you just shut up? What? What if I don't? What are you gonna do? You're you're the one who called me first, so you can hang up anytime. Well, you just threatening to call the police. Hey, you you called me, so hang up anytime you want. And I was kidding about the police. Do I really look like a pussy to you? Do you really think I'm a snitch? Hell no. You need, you need to record yourself and then watch yourself because you know. You um, actually, that should be you who should watch himself. You, you better watch what you say. No, no, no. You should watch what you say. I got a bunch of homie jugs. Wait, your your friends are juggalos? Oh, 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 okay, tell them to have fun looking for Mr. Johnson's head, and while they're at it, to, like, stop, to, like, stop fucking buckets. Probably not gonna remember this guy's name, I'm so gone. What? I'm so gone right now, I don't even know. What am, what am I doing? Like, yeah, you're faking it. You're faking it. No, you just wanted to randomly start shit. Now you're trying to get out of it by saying, oh, like, I'm gaining consciousness after smoking some, like, hallucinative fucking marijuana or some shit. No such thing as that. Fucking makes sense, though. But, dude, seriously, why do you have to, like, do this all the time? No, because you started this, and I'm ending it. Don't you know why I started it? Why? No, I don't understand why you started it. Why? Because I was kidding. Because I was actually kidding around. And what the fuck did my girlfriend had to do with this? Ever since you started another, you've been more of an asshole to like me, Katie. And you, you like say like if she comes over or she's about to, you text me and tell me to be a. Like as soon as she gets there, I'm just gonna like. Because the first time she came over and you like and you and her actually hung out, you're throwing shit at the wall and you nearly broke one of the pictures. Well, nice going. That, okay, well I have an angel problem. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. I no, you do. don't because when I was over, the, when when I knew when we hang out with you, you just we just play PS3 and shit like that, and we go to Mesa. You on the other hand, you like acted like. Oh, I don't have an angry problem. Why did you, did you label me the angry emo kid? Because you, because you always try to be angry over the phone. Like you try to intimidate me, but you really don't. The fuck is that outside? You know, you need. You know, just changes you a new letter. No, she doesn't. She's not. She's not that one bitch I dated. No, her name is Katie, the the other bitch. Well, who the fuck matters about her anyways? I do. Then why don't you go date her? Have fun have fun have fun with the vagina spiders. I don't date yeah, okay. This is what you do, try to act like angry grandpa on the phone. And this is what you try to act like on the phone. You try to act like you're a fucking meathead. You try to act like a douchebag who works out a lot. Like, like you're really gonna scare me. But maybe okay. if you, maybe if you just try harder, maybe if you tried harder, you would actually get a reaction out of me. I'm 
I'm trying to explain something to you, but you don't want to listen. Because why would I li want to listen to someone who who's like shit for brains? Nobody even likes your girlfriend. I didn't tell you anything. Actually, there's a lot of people at my school that like hanging around her because she's actually nice. Nice. No, yeah. she never talks about you guys. Um, live in denial, Danny. No, she doesn't. But okay, how, okay, and and if she did, then how would you even know? Cause she never talks around about me. Uh, because I'm right there and I can hear everything she's saying. I'm not that dumb. I'm standing right there. What you think I'm deaf or something? Okay, and when was this? Today? No, the way she came over when, when like. Down on me, called me a prick, so I left because I wasn't gonna deal with the shit. Which, of course, you'd just be an asshole the rest of that night if I stayed there. That's why I did the smart thing and left. Because oh. knowing you, I would have stayed there. You would have probably like give me dirty ass looks all night and probably say you're you're a prick if you keep bringing it up like you do. No, I yeah, because you actually act like a prick, and you act like a prick over texting and the phone. My mom even p kind of agrees you start shit a lot with me. Okay, you gotta go cry to your mommy about it? No, the, no, because you like to prank call me, and then, and then like, I start yelling, and she's like, who is that? I'm like, fucking CJ always prank call me, and she's like, I know, he's always starting crap with you. And I'm like, yeah, I'm fucking getting sick of it. I don't care what you or anyone thinks. I don't care what your mom thinks, I don't care what Brandon thinks, I don't care what you think, I don't care what anybody thinks, it doesn't, no one's opinion matters. Well, I would also want to know, why do you prank call me with your little boyfriends? Why uh, do you prank call me with yours? Oh, I don't, you called me. No, but like with all those, I can go on YouTube right now and look them all up. Yep, Maybe. go on, actually, go on YouTube right now. Yeah, I yeah, yeah, go on YouTube and look them up, look up the videos. Yeah, I do it because you would prank call me all those freaking times. Okay, I'm and then, and then, and then, and then there was times where you called me, starting shit. Oh, look, there it is. Calling an angry emo kid for. Goodbye.